Hello. I wanted to uh, make a, a quick video. Kind of quick. None of my videos are really that quick, are they? Kind of like flap my lips too much, right? Um, I kind of put that on the wrong spot. It doesn't work, does it? Um, saying thank you. This is uh, video number 1500 or video 1501. Why am I wearing this? I don't know. That's really comfortable. I actually made this all myself, huh? Yeah, I actually know how to use a sewing machine. I made this like 15 years ago. It's actually made out of twill hemp. It's like indestructible. It's made out of hemp. No, I don't like marijuana or anything. It's just, I think hemp is a really neat, comfortable fiber. And um, it's kind of hard to get. Um, um, well, at least in this state, because like hemp is indistinguishable from uh, the stupid uh, thing of marijuana, which I can't even stand the smell of that stuff, so don't even think I'm doing any of that nonsense. Um, I just want to say thank you. And uh, put my hands together, right? Um, while wearing a bowing robe uh, that I made. Um, you know, 1,500 videos. Um, I got actually a lot of videos to make. And, uh, you know, I want to be helpful. And I wanted to be something different than everything else. Which I actually look different than everything else, of course. Maybe I clip that microphone here. It'd be better. Um, I just wanted to say thanks. And, um, you know, I got a lot of videos to make. And I uh, wanted to be different in that, uh, you know, don't have uh, an agenda. You know, I'm not... Not certainly not doing this for the money. That's for damn sure. And uh, you know, once in a while I get worn out. Um, uh, but I've always got tons of videos. What I mean, actually, the emails and the comments, which I love to answer, they take up a lot of time. And uh, the videos don't take up tremendous amounts of time. But the emails and comments do. But yeah, I'm glad I could be helpful. And the feedback has been enormously positive. Yeah, it doesn't matter who you are, what you are, you know, there's going to be a percentage of people that just want to fling poo at you like a monkey in the zoo. And that's to be expected, but actually, what I was expecting was a lot more of poo flinging, but uh, it's actually been incredibly low. And, uh, anyway, uh, my book on uh, the fourth edition of the book, Uncovering the Missing Secrets of Magnetism, is coming out sometime here soon. I mean, I'm literally stressed to the max as far as time that I have to do things, but uh, I wanted to make this video and give you a secret on something Tesla said that nobody ever picked up on. And uh, it's a genuine secret, and uh, I've read all of Tesla's stuff, and people just haven't made the connection. Now, Tesla has said that uh, that uh, he, uh, the one invention of his many inventions that uh, he liked the most was his, uh, you know, his AC, uh, is an AC motor, but uh, it is the case that Nikola Tesla was interviewed in 1928 um, where he said in an article uh, called Famous Prophet of Science Looks in the Future by Popular Science Monthly um, he said towards the end of the interview he asked Tesla which arena of science most applied to him while well, we expected him to mention radios or airplanes uh, the world wireless system or so forth it was, uh, it was not the inductor uh, induction motor that uh, pleased uh, Tesla the most as far as what uh, he created. Instead, it was the discovery of the principle that preceded the induction motor that uh, led to his uh, inventing the induction motor, the rotating magnetic field. Tesla answered, Rotating magnetic fields were dear to my heart. Um, when I made the discovery of rotating magnetic fields, I was a very young man. The revelation came after years of concentrated thought and it was my first great thrill. It was not an, uh, not only a valuable discovery capable of extending practical applications or inventions, it was a revelation of new forces and phenomena unknown to science before. Um, no, Dr. Tesla said with some feelings, I would not give up my rotating magnetic field discovery. He didn't say rotating magnetic invention or generator. For a thousand of my invent thousand inventions, however valuable, designed merely as mechanical contraptions uh, to deceive the eye and the ear. And then he said, uh, a thousand years hence, the telephone and the motion picture camera may be obsolete, but the principle of rotating magnetic fields will remain a vital living thing for all time to come. End quote. Nikola Tesla. And that was from a famous prophet of uh, science. So, 
what people don't understand, and uh, you know, I've linked this to another quote from him from uh, New York uh, World, November 29, 1929 article, uh, page 10, column 4 through 5. Um, like his uh, Edison lamp, my induction motor may be discarded and forgotten. This is Tesla talking. Like Edison's lamp, my induction motor may dis be discarded and forgotten in the continuous evolution of the electric motor and its arts, you know, the arts of, uh, you know, of uh, generators and motors. But my rotating magnetic field with its marvelous phenomena and manifestations of force from magnetism, as meant, will last as long as science itself. The point to be taken away from these two quotes, um, this is my discovery too, and nobody else has ever seen this before, is that Tesla's great pride, his great happiness, his great joy, was not his induction motor invention, rather the discovery of magnetic field reciprocation, the nature of how magnetism works. Um, it is the case, however, that Tesla didn't write anything down regarding how magnets or magnetism works. You might have, and the government could have confiscated it. If so, then, you know, then... Well, we now know he didn't write anything on that that we have. It, it might exist somewhere, um, but uh, this fact has never been seen or deciphered by anyone until now, until my fourth edition of the book. And uh, the important thing is that Tesla had all these inventions, all these inventions, and his great pride and joy was understanding the nature of uh, rotating magnetic fields. No, Dr. Tesla said with some feelings, I would not give my rotating magnetic field discovery for a thousand inventions. He's not talking about his AC motor uh, invention. He's not talking about that. He's talking about the understanding of how uh, magnetism and rotating magnetic fields work. That's really important. His greatest pride is in that comprehension, not his specific inventions. Well, that's pretty amazing. Uh, why doesn't anybody else mention this? It's pretty important. Um, see, Tesla invented all this stuff, but his greatest pride was understanding how magnetism worked. But we have no record of him explaining magnetism. Maybe it was confiscated. Who knows? Maybe he never write it. He meant to write it down, but he died before he could. We'll never know. Um, I, however. Um, you know, I'm so glad that I've figured out how magnetism works and that it's a reciprocating processional hyperboloid. I know what a magnet is. I know how magnetism works. I know how it fits into everything else and what it is by definition, denotation, connotation. I understand magnetism intrinsically. I understand what polarity is intrinsically. And uh, the fourth and the fifth editions, I'm going to have to make many editions of my book because I've got so much to add. Um, you know, whenever I kick off in the future, um, that will be what I have, will have left, is that I will be the first person, at least to have put out there in writing, that people can have access to, and it's free, by the way, um, you know, what magnetism is. So, anyway, I thought I'd pass on that little uh, bit of neat stuff to you from uh, Nikola Tesla that he said about, uh, not his inventions, but rotating magnetic fields. Anyway, thanks for watching, and it's been 1,500 videos now, and uh, I hope I've been helpful, and uh, if not odd and strange or weird to listen to, at least enjoyable and, uh, you know, helpful to some degree, and a lot of people have said that I have been, so that's a good thing, you know, try to be helpful, um, you know, be forthright and uh, useful in some way, shape, or form, and uh, thanks for everything, okay? Any more videos to come? I mean, oh my god, I've got a list of videos to make. Thanks. Bye. <laughs>